Hello and welcome to Dome's PS2 Reviews. If you couldn't tell by that crazy intro, we are reviewing Brunswick Pro Bowling! Now, I hold every bowling game to the standard of Wii Bowling. I don't care if it came out before Wii Bowling or after Wii Bowling. If you're not as good or better, you're garbage. Before we talk about the game, let's go down to Michael Porter and see what's doing in his old brain. Hey Justin, today you're playing Brunswick Pro Bowling. You make it so hard for me, Justin. I mean, it's a bowling game. You want me to find facts for all these games? It's it, it's bowling. Like, it's a garbage game. It's shovelware. It's Brunswick Pro Bowling. Like, what am I supposed to say? Well, you know what? I'm going to make it a point to make a great fact about this game. Time to do some research. Alrighty, Michael. Well, I'm not sure if you need to really take it that seriously. But we're going to go talk about some game footage while you look for some facts about this game. Alright, well you start off by picking your bowler in this game. There's Guy Fieri. Look at him in his little bowling uh, flame shirt there. Then you start bowling, right? Similar to Wii Bowling there. There you have an accuracy meter. But, no matter what the accuracy is, 1% or 100%, you'll pretty much get the same results. There's an 11%, and it should be terrible, right? It's a strike. I don't understand how that's a thing, but it was. So the accuracy meter is already broken when you start the game. That makes it fun for everybody. And then you just have some stupid stuff there. Look at that guy's face. I want to punch him. This game is just awful. Ugh, gutter balls and bull crap for this game all day long. All right, Michael, uh, you really don't need to do anything else. It's fine. You don't need to look for any facts. What's that? I'm getting word in my ear that he has found facts. I don't know. Let's go to Michael and see what he says about the game. Huh. That's kind of weird. So it appears that with this game, the original release was for Wii, PlayStation 2, and PlayStation Portable. And it was developed by Point of View, Inc. But then, a new developer came in, Farsight Studios, and they released a version for PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360, but it's a different game, yet it's still credited as being the same game. And then another developer, Alliance Digital Media, came in and released a PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Wii U version of this game? Is it still the same game, or would it be considered different? I, I'm doing too much digging on this. It's Brunswick Pro Bowling, come on. So does that mean that this game that came out for 2007 on the Wii, PS2, and PlayStation Portable also came out nine years later in 2016 on the Wii U? Huh, that's kind of interesting. So that means I, I did it. I found a fact on this garbage game. I did it! Yeah, I did it! Yeah, I did it! Who do you think you are? I am! That's some Pete Weber for you, baby. All right, thank you so much for watching Dome's PS2 Reviews. Oh, and it looks like this thing just got mold into the gutter ball pile, a.k.a. the trash game pile. This game is trash, it's garbage, it's a gutter ball, it's not a perfect game, whatever you want to say, it's awful. All right, before we let you go, got to remind you all to buy a shirt. Come on, you need a shirt, don't you? Buy one. Shirts, masks, stickers, mouse pads, computer holders, we've got it all. Obviously, that link will be in the comments below. We even got pillowcases for your sleepies. All right, coming up right after this is the giveaway for the John Cena book. It will be happening very shortly, so pay attention to that. Also, subscribe on YouTube. Thank you so much. Have a good one.